really necessary. After 250 volts through my neck, you're lucky you're not back in the trunk. I feel like I got a hickey from jumper cables. You know, I could arrest you for this. Great, do it, I dare you. Oh wait, you'd have to be a real cop. Which, by the way, was the single most attractive thing about you. I can go back to being a cop anytime I want. You know that? Yeah, right. You know why? Why? Because I'm good at it, that's why. Sorry, but I disagree with you. Oh, and you're basing that on? That's based on the fact that there is a black SUV that has been following us and you haven't even noticed. Well, who says he's following us? Because it's the same one that I saw at Dunkin' Donuts when I went to meet Jimmy. You know, there were a million black SUVs and 20 million Dunkin' Donuts, and that's just in New Jersey. Listen, there's a very good chance that cops are involved in the story that I'm working on. Suicide? They may have grabbed Jimmy. Jimmy may have given him my name. I don't know. They may want to kill me. You might think you're hot shit and everything, but I'm pretty sure the only person around here that wants to kill you is me. Milo. God, look at that! Hey, what the heck are you doing? got yourself into. Oh, really? Now you're interested? Yeah, hell yeah. He shot up my car. I, I told you someone was following me. Did you listen to me? No. Do you ever listen to me? You told me somebody jumped off a roof. He worked for the NYPD in the evidence depository. He was afraid of heights, and it's still ruled as a suicide? Come on. Fine. You know, you can tell me all this on the way to jail. You can't be serious. Oh, I want to bet. Bobby signed the report. What? Bobby was the cop who signed off on the suicide. The same one that you Watch said. yourself. OK, very, very thin ice here. He is my friend, too. Oh, so what is this, just a nice, friendly accusation? No, this is not an accusation. This is simply connecting the dots. No, this is about you caring about someone, then all of a sudden, no warning, you don't care about him anymore, and you're out the door. This is not about us, Milo. Bobby. Bobby walked you down the aisle. I know that, and I will be heartbroken. But I'm not going to stand around with my head in the sand. I know exactly where your head is, sweetheart. What? And it ain't in the sand. What are you doing? You know, I'm going to find this prick. And when I do, I'm going to prove Bobby innocent and show you exactly what loyalty looks like. No VIN number. No registration. Yeah, this guy was definitely a pro. Well, I got a Starbucks cup. The name Earl on it. Uh, maybe it's not his cup. Is that all you got? More than you've got, Kojak. I got these. What does it matter that he plays golf? Well, you see, I don't think he does. These clubs have barely been used. Plus, the lefties. The guy who shot at us was a righty. Not to mention the fact that all the pockets are empty. So what? There is not a golfer in the world who doesn't have tees and pencils and balls, shoes, you name it. And why is he a member at the Castle Hill Country Club? That is a good question. Do I ask it? Do I have 
for once now is a good question. 